A new baby is a beautiful thing, but he will turn your world upside down, which is even that much harder when the world around you is being turned upside down as well. I'm Dr. Carrie Firestein, Chief Executive Officer of Allied Physicians Group, practicing pediatrician for 30 years, mother of three, and now grandmother of one. During the COVID epidemic, getting straight answers is very difficult because as pediatricians, we don't know all the answers. In the hospital, you were likely limited about who could come into the delivery and who could come and visit. Probably nobody. Now that you're home, what's the right answer? For all babies, even before COVID, our goal is to keep them from getting sick. So certainly, anybody who's sick should stay away. But if you have somebody who is well, can they come and visit? Right now, the best answer is to maintain social distance. So even grandparents, they can certainly visit, but if you can be outdoors, that's even better. If they wanna hold the baby, and they've been practicing social distancing, and they're well, and they've taken their temperature, and they don't have any symptoms, then you can consider having them hold the baby. I probably would have them hold a mask. I haven't been out anywhere in the world for over 14 days, which is why I have the privilege of holding my grandson. With the risk versus benefit, you also have to think about the grandparents. Depending where you are in the country, you may or may not have been completely social distancing. At this point, most of us in New York are. So the good news is, it's very easy for you to just say everybody should stay away. But the bad news is that it is a solitary time at a time when you probably need a little bit more help. So think of the risk versus benefit. If you need that grandparent to relieve you because babies are tough, they're not also quiet and calm, at least not for most of the day, then think about what that risk benefit is and if it's okay to bring somebody in to give you a little bit of relief. Maybe one of the grandparents like me can choose to not have any contact with the outside world during this time. Thank you for tuning in and our next video is going to be how to calm a fussy baby. Stay tuned.